Okay, in this problem we're asked to find the linearization of f of x, y equals x cubed y minus x, 5x squared y squared plus 2xy cubed. And at the point p equals negative 1, 3. And then for part b we're asked to give an equation for the tangent set of f at the point p. And we want to also estimate f of a when a is equal to negative 0.999 and 2.997. Okay, so for the linearization, We know that the linearization of x at p is equal to f of p plus the gradient vector of f at p dotted with the vector x minus p. So first we're going to want to calculate the value of f of p. So we find that f of negative 1, 3 is equal to negative 3. Minus 45. Plus 54. Or, sorry, minus 54. Which is equal to... negative 102. And then we're also going to want to find the gradient vector of f at p. So first we're going to calculate the partial derivative of f with respect to x. And so we see that that is three x squared y minus ten x y squared plus two y cubed. So we're also going to want to find the partial derivative of f with respect to y. And we get that the partial derivative with respect to y, of f with respect to y is x cubed minus 10x squared y plus 6xy squared. So we're going to want to calculate the partial derivatives at the point negative 1, 3. So this first term is... 9. Second term is negative 90, or positive 90. And the third term is 54. So we find that the partial derivative of f with respect to x at the point negative 1, 3 is 153.
And this first term is going to be a negative 1. And the second term is going to be minus 30. And the third term is going to be minus 54. So we see that the partial derivative of y with or of f with respect to y at the point negative 1, 3 is negative 85. So now we're going to go ahead and use the definition of the linearization to find that The linearization of x of f of x at p is negative 102 plus the vector 153 negative 85 dotted with x plus 1 y minus 3. We can compute the dot product. we get that the linearization of f at p is negative 102 plus 153 times the quantity x plus 1 minus 85 times the quantity y minus 3. And so that's our linearization. We want to find an equation for the tangent set. Well, we can just say that that's z equals that. So then the set of points is simply x, y, and then our z. OK? And now we want to estimate f of a, where a is equal to negative 0 0.999 comma So we know that for points close to our point P, negative 1, 3, f of x is approximately the linearization. So we can just use the linearization, plug in our point A for x into here, and we get the resultant approximation. So we get that f of a is approximately negative 102 plus 153 times 0 0.001 minus 85 times 
negative 0 0.003, which is approximately 